Hey there WordPress merchants, I'm going to show you how to connect your store to OmniSend and create your first form and your first welcome automation. Let me show you. So we are now in the WordPress dashboard and what we want to do is go to the plugins and add a new plugin. And then we're going to look up OmniSend. And this is the plugin that we're looking for. Let's click on install now. Once it's installed, let's activate it. And we now have OmniSend on our WordPress dashboard. Let's go over here and we can connect our store with OmniSend. Let's click here and here you will see the steps what you need to do. But in short, let's go to the OmniSend dashboard and instead connect your store over here and let's click on WordPress. Now we already done the first step, so we need to just copy and paste this specific API key. All right, so now that it is connected, we can go to the OmniSend dashboard and refresh it. Check API connection and it should now be connected on OmniSend as well. So let's enable our first form. Let's go to forms and preview and launch form. This is going to open up an already pre-made form and here we can adjust the form to our liking. But in my case, I kind of like it already. So in step one, it's going to ask for the email and once they get that, you can ask them for the phone as well. But this is multi-step form, which means that if they already enter their email address and they just quit the form after the second step, you already have their email address, even though they did not enter their phone number. So this is excellent because if we want email subscribers, this is an easy way to get that. And if they do both of those, they get this specific page. So let's enable it and see it in action. Okay, but before we do that, if you want to collect SMS subscribers, you need to enter the privacy policy link over here. So in my case, it's going to be OmniSend privacy policy. Once that is in there, we can enable the form. And there we go. Okay, now that we have the form ready, we can go to the automation section and start welcoming our new subscribers to our store. So let's click over here, preview and start workflow, continue setup, and it's going to ask if you want to include SMS channel as well. But in my case, I'm only gonna use the email. So let's start the workflow and there we go. This is it. It was as easy as that. And now let's see it in action. So here it pops up and I'm going to enter my email address. I enter my email address and I move on to the step two. In this case, the marketer already got my email address and they can send me emails. But if I don't want to enter my phone number, they already got it. If I enter my phone number, I'm going to subscribe to both email and SMS marketing messages. But if I just leave it, it's gonna be as it is. And there you go, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. See you later, alligator.